Hello everybody, I've been working on my Seamless Portals add-on for Gears Mod. Um, right now it is on GitHub as an add-on. You can put it in your add-on or you can download it and put it in your add-ons folder and play with it yourself. The only thing I ask is nobody to please like take my code and re-upload it to the workshop or anything. Because that's, that's just me, you know. I don't, I don't like that. Alright, so I'm going to go over what I've been working on in the portals mod. First thing is I've made the portals even more seamless. And you may be, and you may be like me. How in the world did you make it more seamless? It's already like perfect. And you may be like, uh, how, how, could it, how could it possibly be better? It's, it's already perfect. And to that I say, you see this? It's slightly above the ground. And that's a problem. So what I've done is I've added some code to extrude you to the top, so you won't get stuck in it anymore. This is super nice because if you even even if there's like a tiny little gap like this, uh, it can it can still mess up. Uh, so now it's it's perfect and seamless. And you may be like me, you have the biggest ego I've ever seen. And yes, yes, you may be right. Uh, but it also took me three hours to get that working. So I'm going to let you be the judge of who should have the bigger ego. <laughs> All right. Second thing that I've I've done is the same code that I just talked about like a couple seconds ago. I can put this portal on the roof, have it hang down like this, and I can go through with no issue. Uh, hold up, I need like a table or something to get me back up there. There we go. And I can jump back through, and it works perfectly fine. As you would expect, almost no um, problems with like getting stuck in the ceiling here or anything weird. No, it's perfectly fine. It uh, works, works amazing. All right. The third thing that I've been working on is getting props to work through the portals. It's a little buggy right now, but it sort of works. So actually, here, let me take this portal. In. Get out of here, so it's a little easier to see what's going on. All right, so I can take. Um, actually, where is that? There it is. Okay, I can take this, and I can put it through the portal, kind of. Don't worry about that. I can put it through the portal, and it goes through, sort of. It's work very work in progress. I'm more focused on the stupid black halo thing that you can see when you hold something like an object with the physics gun it's super annoying and i want to fix that any please any lua devs or whatever that may know how to fix that I, I really need help because it's super annoying and i haven't found a fix for it yet all right so you can go through or you can go on the prop or whatever and it works like prop you can go on it and stuff it works pretty well, it's just I forget to clip the back here. Third thing I've done is improved the visual look when you look through a portal like this. So as you can see the it's 3D. It didn't it didn't used to be 3D, but now it's 3D. Um Yeah, I've also improved bullets, so I doubt anyone will notice this, but I've I've done a ton of optimization to the code. I've also moved some stuff around to make it as smooth as possible. And you can shoot through the portals and it ends up pretty much where you'd expect it to end up. Normal like before it didn't really do that. It was a little offset, but I fixed that. So it's working perfectly fine now. It's, it's perfectly fine. All right. The that's pretty much it. Again, code will be on GitHub. Uh, if you want to check it out and maybe install for yourself or something. Again, please nobody upload this to Workshop. Not only is it work in progress and super buggy, it's also like mine. <laughs> it's not yours, so I'm going to upload my work to the Workshop. Alright, uh, last thing I forgot to mention is I added uh, multiplayer support and you, be, and you may be like me. 
uh, didn't it already work in multiplayer? Aren't you on like a local server right now? Well, the problem was that if your ping was higher than like 10, the portals would get super flashy and stuff. So that's fixed now. I have this uh, fake lag command here that basically allows me to fake what my ping is. So if I set this to 50, my ping will eventually increase until it's about like 100 or something. It'll keep going up. As you can see, I'm not going to let it sit there for too long. And when I go through, even though my ping is 100, it's pretty close. It used to be, trust me, it used to be so much worse than this. Like, this is this is a major improvement to what it was before. But still, uh, unfortunately, is a little jarring. So again, any little nerds that may be able to help out, you can do a pull request to the GitHub link in the description. And I will... Um, I will try and add it and play around with it and see if it's like any better and I'll fork it to the album. Because it's it's not perfect. It's not perfect. I'm working on it. Alright, that's that's it for now. Um again, for like the third time or whatever, the GitHub link will be in the description. All you have to do is uh download the code for yourself, uh and then like extract it to your add-ons folder and it should work. Play around, uh, play around with it. Tell me if there's any bugs or whatever. And uh, yeah, hopefully I will see you next in another video.